So it was full of water, and all we did was clean out the drain. It's as easy as this, right? So, and then once you clean, and then this here is the drain. It's very similar to the Whirlpools. Just unscrew this, and then it'll drain out. Once it's drained out, then you can pull this. If it doesn't drain out too fast, then that means this is too plugged up, so you're gonna have to stick a bucket under there and pull it out that way. And that will solve your die woo problem. Die woo woo. <laughs> All right. So you have to go right side up. And Okay. Because what I like to do is sometimes it'll come on and once it heats up a little then it won't even come on again. So we gotta just make sure it comes on a second time and do you want me to get it on high heat? Like get it uh, as as possible? Or does that matter? Uh, it doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. And so this vent here that vent there, I would kind of like to see it at one straight shot going out rather than curling it around. So, um, what do you cut them with? Do you just cut it and then? Uh, you can cut it with a razor blade, okay. yeah, or a steak knife. Okay. Yeah. Actually, I got him a nice knife for his birthday. Oh, uh, we'll okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If you want, I can do that now. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. This here, he wants to see just a straight rather than a curve. So I'm going to bring him over with this. So either you're going to straight. Oh, okay, so if these get clogged up, take some hot vinegar and run them through them. Like a die wound.